The point here is to show, of course, how uh, cinema can capture uh, the globality uh, of uh, the human experience and transcends a linguistic, cultural, historical barrier by uh, allowing the audience to explore through a common theme how similar uh, uh, our, or are connected our uh, human experience is all throughout the globe. As you know, St. Cloud doesn't offer the most diverse screen when it comes to showing uh, international cinema in commercial theaters. Uh, well, it's about demand and supply. Um, you know, uh, no one's gonna play it if uh, nobody's gonna come and watch them. Yeah, I think it's more the fact that they just don't get as much promotion. Uh, that's also one of the reasons we're very proud of our uh, film series because it's a rare window to international cinema. I think like St. Cloud State is so diverse and people are so open to learning new cultures and stuff like that. So I think, yeah, I think it will be something good for students. Before each film, I introduce, uh, I frame the, the, the film in the following way, giving historical, sociopolitical, uh, philosophical, uh, landmarks so that the viewers can connect with the film in a more meaningful way. After the film, we engage in an informal yet extremely stimulating and demanding uh, analysis of the film. The motif, the themes, uh, the visual strategies, the structural uh, um, motif of the film, etc., etc. I just think it's because not enough people know enough about um, global culture. Like they only know about domestic culture, and they don't. And they, they just don't understand it. It hasn't made its way out here yet. It's. Um, I don't think there's too much of an interest in foreign films. I think people are looking more to see American actors and American films. And I'm usually showing American films that may feel to the American audience as foreign in terms of the experience that, they, that it provides, uh, in terms in the way it refracts American uh, politics and identity in a quite challenging and stimulating way for the average American audience. It's a way of uh, celebrating cinema as a community event, event but also a way to uh, make sure that cinephilia, the love and knowledge for cinema, its history, uh, its influences on society is still alive.